everyone, today we're going to be making hexaflexagons. They are this really cool folding toy that you see me playing with on screen. I have created two patterns for you guys to print out using the link below. In this video, I will be showing you how to make both patterns, although the instructions are exactly the same. Here's a quick look at how the car pattern will turn out if you choose to use it. The things you will need to make a hexaflexagon are one pattern, either the flower or the car pattern, scissors, glue, and that's it. First step is to cut out your pattern. Make sure when you're cutting your pattern that you are cutting along the gray lines and that you don't cut off the white triangle at the end of the pattern. The next step is to fold your pattern. Fold it in half along the gray line and then fold along the diagonal gray lines to fold the triangles. Try to fold as many lines as you can and eventually your shape will start to become a hexagon. This takes a little bit of time, but don't get frustrated, you're almost there. You know you're doing it right when the patterns start to line up like here on the screen for me. When the flower lined up with all the pieces together, that means I've done it correctly and I'm ready to glue. Find the remaining flap that has the exact same pattern on both sides. Then put glue on it and tuck it into the pocket. And then you're all done. Fold it a couple more times over on itself to make sure that it's completely folded and you didn't miss any of the gray lines. Once you're done, you should be able to play with it just like I played with it in the beginning of the video. something went wrong and your hexaflexagon doesn't work or you're not happy with the results, you can always take a go at the car pattern or try again with the flower pattern. For the car pattern, the instructions are exactly the same. For the first step, you're going to cut it out along the gray lines and remember not to cut the white triangle off the bottom. Then you are going to fold it along the middle gray line and then fold it along the diagonal gray lines to create the triangles. After a couple folds, your shape will start to look like a hexagon. Start looking for the patterns that match up. I found the purple car in this video. 
That means I've done it right. Lastly, find the flap with the same pattern on both sides and tuck it into the pocket. As you can see, it takes me a couple tries to find it, so don't worry if you didn't find it in the first try. Put some glue so that it stays, and that's it, you're all done! Fold it over on itself to make sure that you fold it along all of the gray lines, and then you're ready to play just like I did in the beginning of the video. And that's it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Bye.